Welcome back, fuckers. All right, we're gonna run through how to drop a laser guided bomb. All right, so we're gonna we went through how to set up the targeting pod. Now we're gonna go through putting everything together. How to set how, uh, how to set up the uh, laser codes. Set your bomb in the right configuration. So we're gonna go ahead and do it for real now. So we are going to get our bomb loaded up. So master arm on. Select air to ground. And here we go. We've got our Mark 82 laser guided or GBU-12s as they're known. Mode is CCIP, E-Fuse is instant, and drag we can't change. Quantity one, multiple one, and we've got our laser code 1688, set for both stations. Down here on our targeting pod, we are going to, using the skills that you just learned before, pick out a target, so let's go this guy right here. Zoom in. Okay, so, couple of uh, things you can do right now with the targeting pod if you press so at the moment my sensor of interest is the bottom MFD so if I press sensor select aft once it's gonna go into area track if I press it again it's gonna go into point track mode so if it's a moving target you press point track and it's gonna lock on to that target there and if this BTR decides to fly, uh, drive around my targeting pod will follow it okay so press it again and it goes back to normal so once you have designated the area track you can't slew the uh, targeting pod around so you can't bump it and get rid of an area so just say you found a let's go back to this say you wanted to hit uh, let's go that Okay, that bunker right there. Right, like, cool, that's where I want it to be. Bam, done. It's good to go. It's not gonna move from here, but we still gotta do a couple of things here before we can drop our bomb. If it's a moving target, press it again, and it goes to the two lines, that's point track mode. And you can also see at the top, PTRK, point track, and then press again, you go to the diamond. Right, so we need to designate a spot on the ground. So we're going to zoom in on this guy again we will get him pretty much there we're going to press tdc depress again to designate the spot on the ground so now our bomb full line is looking at that spot there right we've got our bomb selected and we've got some symbology on the heart so we are in auto laser mode so this is a cool thing that's been added before you had to uh, we're going to go ahead and arm the, the laser Okay, auto laser, and then you've got manual laser trigger. So if you want to fire the laser manually, you box trigger, and when you press the gun trigger, the trigger that fires the gun, press and hold, it says LTD slash R. So our laser is lasing the target right now. Let it go, it stops. So trigger if you wanna go manual, if you just leave trigger unboxed, it says auto up here. And we've got a 73 rel, so that's our time in seconds until we can release said bomb. So we're gonna go ahead and hit unpause, line ourselves up. So we're in auto mode now, so we don't have to worry about diving down on the target. We're just gonna get ourselves in autopilot. Doesn't have to be precise, but you wanna line up the bomb full line with the middle of your velocity vector and just fly along. So we're in autopilot here, cruisy, cruisy mode. Got our target designated down there. And we'll switch to uh, FLIR, just because it looks better when the bomb hits. Zoom out a touch. We're just going to keep an eye on our release queue. As soon as it gets to 10 seconds, a your bomb full line is going to start, roughly about there, and it's going to descend down. Once the line falls through your velocity vector, the weapon will pickle from the jet, which is going to be off our right hand inboard. All right. To light, five seconds. So pressing and holding pickle now. Two, one weapon away and confirm one is gone and let's go ahead so remember we haven't done anything yet we have to count down now 20 seconds till the laser is going to turn on we go to f6 view which is the bomb view bomb isn't tracking yet so as soon as our laser turns on in 10 seconds three two one you should see it kick in bam it's picked the laser up now it's tracking itself in Okay, so our aircraft is lasing that target. And it's about to be one dead BTR. 
Boom! Shakalaka. That is one dead. BTR down there. Laser guided bomb. Eat your heart out. So right now it's black because our aircraft is blocking the uh, the camera. So you can see here this little dot that's moving around. This is the direction that our laser or our camera is looking. So at the moment it's looking kind of behind us and to our left. And if you look there, it's trying to see, but it's blocked by itself by the own uh, targeting pod. So you're going to keep in mind, if you lose sight of the target, the laser is not actually going to work and the bomb will go stupid. So as we are, we're just going to hook around in a bit of an orbit here. Level ourselves out. Still not quite there. Let's... So because the targeting pod's on our left cheek station, you want to go in a left-hand orbit if you can help it to try and keep the targeting pod looking at the area. So now we're going to go altitude on again and we're going to find another target and this time we're going to watch it in let's go set this guy up press tdc to press and the exact same thing only thing is in auto mode right this is this, this will catch you out so as soon as your bomb is dropped your laser will turn off so you got to rearm it again so make sure you click on the button so it says arm Lasers armed, and then we're going to do the same thing. We're going to roll on in to so make sure it says L arm on the heart. If it doesn't say that, when you press and pickle, your bomb will come off the rail, but you won't actually be lazy. Same deal, autopilot on and get ourselves roughly in the area. 10 seconds when it gets to five, we'll have the bomb full line. You're going to press and hold pickle. Weapon away. Oh god. Alright. Again, we've got a countdown to the laser comes on. 15 seconds. Put ourselves in a slight left hand orbit. And let's zoom out here. Remember, wherever our targeting pod's looking, the laser is going to fire right there. So we're going to get it right out. Laser is on. 8 seconds, time to impact. It just looks cool in Fleer, I don't know why. It's just there's something satisfying about it. You should see our bomb enter anytime now. Bam! Weapon has done its job. It's a dead BTR. And that is how you do laser guided bombing. Uh, if a JTAC is down there, okay, lasing a target. So say we've got a JTAC or someone else is lasing a. Uh, a target down there you can use ccip mode all right and use someone else's laser to hit a target as well we'll cover that at a another tutorial all right guys i hope that helps that is laser guided bombing 101 hope you enjoyed catch us on the next one